Check this out. Get a look at this, yeah. Get close in. You don't want to miss this. Way. Welcome back to another food troll food review. Now, before we start our review, I just want to say if you guys have got any recommendations, if you guys know any places that we should be checking out, or maybe some of you guys want to sponsor one of our reviews, you can do so by checking out our Instagram page. There it is. DM us on uh, Instagram and we will get back to you ASAP. For any, if you, if you want to drop some comments saying any feedback or anything like that, get in touch with us on Instagram. Whew. Right, formalities done. Let's crack on with the review. Today we have come to the high street in Walls End. We're going to be trying out my masala. Quick flick. Now these guys are doing some exceptionally good food. They do naan babs, but we are here to try out their my masala munch box. This one is going to be special. Right then guys, let's get munching. Right then guys, here we are. Take a look at this. Now then, before I start my review, these guys have been here since 1979. 1979, that is what? 42, 40, 42 years? 42 years this family business has been producing some exceptional food. I've got to take my hat off to them for that. 42 years is a long, long time. Right then, here, come closer then. We've got a little message there as well. Enjoy. Right, what did we get? What did we get? Hey guys, we got ourselves. Check this out. Get a look at this then. Get close in. You don't want to miss this. Way. Right, this is the My Masala box. You've got onion bhajis. Vegetable pakoras, masala chips, you got shish kebab, you got chicken tandoori, you got chicken tikka, and guess what? At the bottom, you've got a keema naan as well. Also, with the masala box, these guys are giving you a curry. You can get a jalfrezi, you can get a balti, you can get what you want. It's give us, I think, a jalfrezi, I'm not sure. So you get a sauce with, wow, with the box itself. And then let's get stuck in guys. We've also got some Kima cheesy chips. We'll try them after we've tried this. Let's make a start. First things first, onion bhajis. Have a look at the onion bhaji there. Let's get stuck into that. Mm. Got a nice crispy outer to it, full of flavor. Getting closer, have a look. Nice crispy outside, full of flavor on the inside, and the onions well cooked. Mm. Nice. Now, then, you also got some vegetable pakoras. We got a bit of masala on there as well. Hi, right, fella, you all right? Vegetable pakoras, let's give these a whirl. Wow. You know what? This box here, it's cost me 16.50 if I'm correct. Well worth it. You're getting your starters. You're getting a good portion of chips and you've got plenty of meat. And don't forget the key manon which we're gonna get stuck into. These pakoras are nice. They're the kind of pakoras you probably get at a restaurant if you went to Indian Tandoori and ordered some of these pakoras. Mm. Lovely. Right. Let's have a look at these masala chips. Well coated with masala. Mm. They are absolutely amazing. Look at the chip itself. Let's get close to the chip. Look at that potato content in there. Let me open that for you. Them are not your cheap chips. Them are not the kind of chips that you're going you're gonna to get at these cheapy, shitty little restaurants. Them are nice, decent chips. And they've got a fantastic... Look at the coating of masala on that. 
lovely coating of masala not too spicy you can get this in a mild medium or spicy we've gone for the medium because you know me i don't like too much spice masala chips are absolutely amazing mm. it's a busy high street however you can park your cars along the front here hawking is not going to be an issue right let's move on to the meat first things first let's have a look at the chicken get a look at the juices in here is it look at that look at them juices wow Wow. That chicken is soft, it's tender, and it's dripping with juice. One thing about this, uh, the masala box, you can choose which masala you want on it. The kebabs, the meats, you can have a jalfrezi sauce, you can have a balti sauce, you can have a masala sauce. Just one of the many options you can have when you get one of these boxes. That chicken, I want to, let's, I'm going to start finding a knife if I can find a knife. We don't seem to have a knife. Let's get our hands in here. Look at that. Well cooked, dripping with masala flavor. Wow. You know what? That is banging. Banging, banging, banging. Right. Shish kebab. Got to cross this one here. Once again, cooked in the sauce as well look at that wow that looks absolutely unreal <laughs> the taste of that shish combined with the masala on top of it is absolutely a beautiful beautiful combination then what we're gonna do now is let's start getting a look at this naan underneath all this heavenly food we have also got a keema naan can you believe it i'm sorry guys my hands are getting dirty but when the food's this good mm. that naan it's warm, it's well cooked, and my fork is snapped. No good. Come here closer here, Zen. Let's try getting a bit of this lamb bread here. Look at that. Perfectly cooked, mate. Perfectly cooked. Drenching in sauce, full of flavor. Absolutely exceptional. some tissue right then I do apologize it's getting a bit messy but there's that much masala there's that much sauce there's that much spice and that coming on I don't mind it to be honest with you because the food is absolutely delicious let's have a try this sauce they're giving this sauce as well have a look look at that I'm so glad I made that journey through the time tunnel to get here. Ooh, got a bit of a kick on it as that. Right, is there anything we missed out here? We've got some chicken tikka here as well, Zen. Let's try this chicken tikka. You know what? I rest my case chicken absolutely amazing the tikka the tandoori chicken as well with that naan bread i cannot get over how good that naan bread is oh. rubicon these cans are absolutely chilled absolute chilled nice and cold hit the spot Right then, now we're gonna get stuck into get a close up here. This one's gonna be special, mate. We have got some Kima cheesy chips. Oops, I've left my fork in here. Wait for it, wait for it, guys. Wait for it, wait for it. Here it comes. 
here it comes let's have a look oh look at that look at that loaded fries with kima kima and cheese <laughs> take a look at that guys wow can you see the steam coming off that eh the chips yeah the chips are nice they've got a really good wholesome potato feel about them which i think a lot of burton do a lot of chip shops nowadays don't really provide you with quality chips but these chips full of potato content with the spice and everything else on top take one look at that before i polish it off have a look at that hey it's crying out in it it's crying eat me eat me eat me wow that is absolutely amazing you can taste the chips you can taste the kima you can taste the cheese you've got three lots of different flavors coming out mate this has been absolutely well worth the drive up exceptional food my masala yeah they've also got a 10% discount uh, get 10% discount if you like us on Facebook you can download their app my masala app uh, open till late they open at five o'clock till late hey up oh, they even open every night so they work in seven days off the belt which I think is pretty good right then when you're producing food like this I suppose there's a big demand and I expect customers to say right also just eat as well you see the shop from there plenty of parking right guys enough talking let's start munching have a look at that Zen one last go of that mate eh mm. right then let's move on let's move on to their sauces look at the sauces I've got as well we're here we have got mint sauce sweet chili sauce naga sauce which i suppose is going to be the hot one and we've got the good old garlic sauce what we're going to do with these we're going to sample these one at a time i'm going to be using our masala chips let's try the naga one whoa <laughs> right look at that nice creamy texture to it Right, and I know this is gonna be hot. I know it's gonna be spicy, mate. Dripping. Get a look at that. Oh, ooh. Whew. That's got a kick on it. Definitely got a kick on it. Right, we're gonna move on to the garlic. As you all know, I'm a big fan of garlic. Get close into that. So you're gonna have a chip, you got the masala spice on it, you got a bit of garlic as well. Strong garlic taste to it. If you like your garlic strong, this garlic is definitely for you. That is absolutely amazing. You know what? This place got recommended to us. I was supposed to come down here in July, but a few things happened, I couldn't get down and I promised myself that I would be coming down. Here I am. Right, mint sauce. Have a look at the mint sauce. Mint sauce is a very popular dish when it comes to Asian food. Everybody claims to be the masters at it. Let's have a taste of this. Wow. Absolutely amazing. Right, sweet chilli. Quickly going through the sweet chili as well. There. Wow. I'm not a big fan of sweet chili, but you know what? That tastes absolutely delicious. It's got a nice creamy texture to it. Wow. Guys, what can I say? My masala, well worth the drive, well worth the drive, well worth paying £1.90 to the time tunnel to get to you guys. Right then, score time. This is the one, guys. Quick recap, onion bargies, lovely, nice crispy, nice strong onion taste to them, lovely little spices coming through. 
vegetable pakoras. Got a bit closer, you lay the crunch. How are you doing guys? You alright? We are. Nice, crispy. You heard the crunch of them pakoras. Yeah? Now, the meats as well. That shish kebab with this masala sauce. Absolutely amazing. Shish kebabs can be a, become a bit dry. But with that sauce, it's as though them shish kebabs they become really juicy. Masala sauce coming through them. You got that strong taste of the meat coming as well with the herbs and the spices. Chicken beautifully cooked. Masala absolutely amazing. And that keema naan. Wow. Now, keema cheesy chips. Like I said, sometimes the keema can become a bit overpowering. It can take away the taste of the chips and the cheese. Everything was perfectly, perfectly, perfectly balanced. Sauces, each and every one. Have a look at the sauces. I've got them stacked up nice for you. Sauces, each and every one, absolutely exceptional. Score time. My masala, the food troll today, on a dampish, well, a dull afternoon is going to give my masala a massive, respectable 9.2. This place has officially been food troll certified.